Hello fellow crafters, my name is Kim Moldy and I live in Littleton, Colorado. My favorite item to knit for Knit for Peace is mittens and the tip I'm going to share with you today is my favorite mitten pattern. It is designed by Tin Can Knits and it's called the World's Simplest Mittens. You can find this pattern and download it for free on the Tin Can Knits website or on Ravelry. What I like best about this pattern is that it gives you instructions for knitting five sizes of gloves from toddler to adult large. Here's a picture of a child's glove that I knit from that pattern. And then an adult large, which would fit a man. I also like that it includes instructions for using a variety of yarn weights from fingering to chunky giving you the correct needle size to use for the pattern size that you're knitting and also the correct number of stitches. It's a really well-written pattern. It's quite adaptable and it's great for beginners. So I encourage you to give it a try if you've been considering knitting mittens as your next challenge. Thank you for all you do for Knit for Peace. Hey, I'm Mary Ellen Garrett in Denver. To make mittens warmer, I double up the yarns. So using either two strands of worsted weight yarn or one worsted and one sock weight. When I'm finishing the thumb, I pick up two additional stitches from this area to add to the ones already on the stitch holder to make the area stronger where the thumb meets the mitt. Then when finishing weaving in my ends on the inside, I stitch back and forth over this area several times to also make that area stronger and um, tighter. Thank you so much for making and donating mittens to Knitting for Peace. Hi, I'm Erin and I'm from Denver. And I support Knitting for Peace by making mittens. So this mitten is almost finished. I'm just on the thumb right now. I've used the magic loop technique and I'm knitting with um, fingering weight wool yarn mixed with some nylon. It's machine washable and dryable, so it makes it easy for people that are getting the mittens to take care of them. Here's his little mate. And you may wonder um, why I have purple mittens and I'm wearing purple. That was intentional. So um, I hope you try knitting mittens. It's fun, it's easy, they're little and portable. I can knit a pair of mittens in about a week if I stay, stay with it. And uh, also if you've never used the magic loop technique, there are great videos on YouTube. So get your needles ready and cast on some mittens. You're going to enjoy it. Thank you.